Norman snuck across lawns and driveways under the cover of darkness. The headlights of a car approached, and he ducked in behind a bush until it had passed out he stayed there until it disappeared around a corner in the distance, then he poked his head around the front to make sure the coast was actively clear. There were some teenagers talking on the sidewalk a little way down the quiet suburban street, but he figured it was safe enough to come out. If he was caught, he didn't know what would happen to him. The only thing he knew is that capture was not an option. This was his time, without any agenda or expectations. He saw an unfamiliar face coming down the same side of the street just a few yards away. He warned the intruder, off, but he kept coming closer. An altercation seemed inevitable. Just then, someone threw on a light and stepped out onto the porch. Both Norman and the interloper fled in opposite directions. Norman dove and hid under a low deck until he saw the light switch off and heard no more movement. He stepped carefully out into the night, confident but cautious. He was at large, and any other creatures stirring in the night would need give him a wide berth. Back home, Norman stood in the window sipping a tea. It was a crisp fall evening, and it had been an hour since Norman had meowed to be let outside. He wasn't sure where he went during these evening constitutionals, but he certainly hoped his cat was having fun.